Hello, and welcome to Lightworks. In this video, we're going to have a look at creating the Multicam bin. The Lightworks Multicam bin contains synchronized material that's locked together. The material is locked together either by the timecode tracks or by a specific lock frame, such as a clapperboard or flash frame. Let's go ahead and sync up some material. In this bin here, Concert Multicam, I've got four shots that share a common timecode. Let's sync them all together by that timecode track, either Select the shots you require, or if you want all of them, go straight ahead, right click, choose Make Multicam Bin. You'll be prompted to name the resulting Multicam Bin, to choose the synchronized method, either time code or the current frame the shots are parked on. In this case, I'm going to use the time code track and set the display tile size for the Multicamera Bin. Hit Do It. The Multicam bin is created and that's denoted by the little green LED in the bins list. These shots are now slaved together. And we're ready to edit. Let's have a look at the second synchronization method using the lock frame. In this bin here, I've marked specific frames which are in sync with the lock frame graphic. Let's park all of these shots on that lock frame. Now intentionally, on this shot here, I've missed out the correct frame. We'll correct that once we make the multi-camera bin. Right click in the bin, we use the bin settings menu. Choose make multi-camera bin. This time we'll choose the method by the current frame. Hit do it. Once again, these shots are now slaved together. Of course only three are parked on the correct lock frame, we need to adjust the fourth. To do so, go to the settings menu, go to the option allow lock adjustments and turn it on. Now we can reset to the correct frame. The name overlay will flash red during the lock adjustments. These are all set correctly now and I'm happy with that. Go back, turn off lock adjustments. and everything's in order, ready for editing. Using the Content Manager Integrated Search tool, you can search directly for multi-camera bins. Open the Search tool, choose the Bins tab, select Multi-camera bins, and punch the details in. Sync 1. Or Sync 2. The bin is highlighted in the bins list and you'll switch straight to the bin. If you don't add any details in the name criteria and hit search, multi-camera bins in your bins list will simply be highlighted. If you'd like to open your material into larger viewers while you're editing, you can do so simply by right-clicking and choosing display the viewers. By default, Lightworks will display the viewers across the top of the screen. To hide them, right click, choose hide. If I set the position of the viewers elsewhere, this position will be remembered next time we return to the multi-camera bin. Let's go to another bin, and then back. The viewers are displayed. If you don't want the viewers to be automatically displayed, Again, right click and choose Automatically Restore Viewers set to No. Now I can just hide these away. You might want to have just the viewers open and minimize the bin. Display the viewers 
and go to the bottom right of the multi camera bin and select compact mode. The bin's collapsed, but the viewers remain. To exit compact mode, just uncheck compact. We'll look further into assembling the multi camera edit in another tutorial. We hope that's helpful. Thanks for watching.